Greetings guys and girls and welcome back to Gamers Play Sunday Spotlight. Today we are going to have a go at The Sims 3. This is a game that a lot of you have already played. I know I've played it over and over and over again. Really, really enjoy it. But I wanted to try out something a bit different where I'm not actually in control of the characters at all. I'm just giving them their traits, create them and let them get on with it. So, well, let's let them get on with it. See what happens, shall we? And how do I unpause? Let's... <laughs> Here we go. Okay, now, if you are wondering, I have, let's see, controlling flow, go away, don't care. Um, if you are wondering, yes, I have got, go away, stupid things. Um, where are we? Uh, I hate the controls in this game. Here we go. Right, okay, we can see absolutely everything that's happening. Um, yes, the guy over here, let's go and check him out. His name is G-Play. And yes, you may realise he is based on a character from my previous game. Purple Mohawk and, yep. Yeah. But I'll tell you about their traits in a minute because that's gonna, that should make for something really interesting. But oh, go away, I don't care. But, um, yes, you may notice the name of this character, Ryan Croft. <laughs> <laughs> this is Ryan's character. This is Lara Croft, or a version of her. And I don't care if there are many different ways. Go away. I don't care. Go away. Oh, okay. All I want to do is just watch what these characters are going to do. Now, this guy over here, the blonde guy with the sort of weird t-shirt, that's Jack. Which, we just, um, I, I deliberately gave them traits to see how they would interact with it. Now, she wants to join the law enforcement. What should be interesting is this guy wants to join the criminal career track. Hang on, they get along. How could they? Okay, that's weird. I'm going to show you the traits that they've got. Let, let me see. Where's where's their traits? Uh, do we do we do do we do we dum dum opportunities? Do, which which which? Oh, it's all here. Yes, as you can see, G Play is an insane genius. He's athletic, he's evil, and a kleptomaniac. So naturally, he'd want to be a criminal. But Ryan, <laughs> I can't get over calling her Ryan. But yes, Ryan is insane, flirty, athletic, evil, and a computer whiz. So if she's evil, why on earth would she want? to join the police. I have no idea. But anyway, and Jack, he's still a teenager. So yes, Jack, if you're watching this, you're still a teenager. I don't care what you say, you are still a teenager. You're in college, you're a teenager. Anyway, you are absent-minded, insane, excitable, and childish. That's kind of you in a nutshell. Jack, just so you know. And yes, I did. No, I didn't actually base these personalities on the real people. Yes, I did, Ryan. You're a flirty, insane, athletic, evil computer whiz. That's what you are. So, I wonder what it's actually going to happen. I'm just going to leave them and. Oh, this is difficult. I really want to interact with them. I really want to get them to do stuff. But no, 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 no. I mustn't. I mustn't get them to do stuff. We're just going to watch and see what happens. Um. No! Okay, Ryan, you seem to be having a go at a wall. <laughs> okay, so they need to... Okay, we, well, I'm going to help them a little bit. Right, okay, you want to find a job. Get a job. Go on. Hurry up, then. Get a job. Because they can't do things like buy a computer, for example. So I'll have to do some bits and pieces for them, won't I? So go and find a job, you stupid bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, honestly, I mean, I keep having to go at Lara Croft in the Tomb Raider series. I do. When she ever, she just, ah, I say, get your guns out. What does she do? She gets a flare. A flipping flare. A fudging flare. Available jobs. Hey, perfect. Law enforcement. First one. Accept. Lovely. I'd love to hang out with you and know you better. I don't care. Shag, shag. Zarboso. Go away. Don't care about those things. Okay, now it's your turn to get a job. Go on, where's, where's the newspaper? What did... Ryan, what did you do with the newspaper? What did you... Are you recycling? Where is it? Is it in your inventory? Where is it? Yes, it is. Okay, let's put it there. Okay, now... You find a job. Jack, you need a computer. How much money have we got? 3,000. Is that enough to buy... A computer thingy. Let's see. Uh, first of all, need a desk. Yeah. That'll do. <laughs> do you like this music, guys? It's a bit weird, if you ask me. But anyway. And need a chair. Where's a cheapo chair? Cheapo chair. Cheapo. That one will do. Has to be cheap. They haven't got much money. And now for the computer. 
Is there enough money for a computer? Just about. I can't actually see. Okay, right, let's see if that... Okay, they've got a computer now. Lovely. Jack, you want to go play computer games? Come on. Can't use it. Why can't you use it? And <laughs> first time! Brilliant criminal. Fantastic. Okay. And Jack, come on, Jack. Why can't you use that? Must have a chair to use. You've got a chair there. Okay. <laughs> Jack, you're scaring Ryan. Okay, fair enough. Ryan, move so I can adjust the chair. Move. Thank you. Right. There we go. Right. Done. Lovely. They can use the computer now. Brilliant. In buy mode, blah, blah, blah. Don't care. Um, so, what's, what's, who's going to burn the house down first or do whatever? You're, I mean, there's plenty of evil people here. There should be something a bit more interesting than this going on. But um, you're brushing your teeth. Well, it's good. Dental hygiene is very important, even for virtual characters. But um, anyway. Now they're chatting. Don't chat. Do something interesting. Go on, do something interesting. Okay, clap at a computer. Well done. <laughs> this is stupid. Okay. Normally I'd be getting them to do stuff, but no, 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 I don't want to. I want to see what happens, you know. Um, just naturally. Well, how natural can it be if it's in a computer game? It can't be that natural, but I just want to see what happens with as little interference with me as possible. Now, what's this? Get a part-time job. You want a job as well? What are you doing? You're playing computer games. Well done, Jack. Playing computer games like you're supposed to. Uh, I didn't actually show you the character creation because I actually find that bit... It can be kind of funny, but it's kind of a bit dull as well. But, <laughs> you know, uh, what the hell. Where's... What are you... Okay, so you two are just going to sit down there. Are you? I tell you what, this is a bit boring. Let's speed it up and see what happens. <laughs> Nicola. Literally for hours they just stand and sit and do nothing. This is this is really boring. Okay, let's have a look at their needs. Where are their needs? Skim. What what skill? What? You, huh? Okay, I need to zoom out a little bit so I can get. But there we go. Right here we are. We can see a bit more of what's going on. Uh, oh, he's cooking. I wonder if he's going to burn down the house. No, he just burnt the toast. Okay. Uh, yeah, go away. This is the one I wanted. Here we go. Okay. Sims still need basic uh, take. Go away. I don't care. Let's just get on with it. Right. Okay. And oh, Jack, you good boy. You did the washing up. And G plays cooking again. Why? It's not in your traits. Cooking is not in your. I don't know. I don't know, and I don't care. So, what are you guys doing now? You, Ryan, are on the computer. <laughs> Unfortunately, it seems that Mary Ellen isn't with you to scream at playing, what was it, Outlast? Yeah. Of which your new videos out on Atomic Blue Productions. I really have to watch that. I haven't watched that one yet. So they just come out today, admittedly. I haven't had a chance to watch it, but I'm going to, definitely. Jack, you need the toilet. And you're sitting in bed. Look, toilet, toilet, bladder down at zero. Do you mate? <laughs> Thank you for the blur. Glad that's there. I'm sure there's certain things that we really don't need to see even in a virtual world like Sims 3. Now what? Come on. Okay, Ryan, you're gossiping on the phone. I get the impression that that's something that you do quite often. G Plate, you look to the computer and that's it. Okay. Fair enough. You're not... There's not really anything interesting going on, is there? Or maybe, oh, am I missing something? Oh, yeah. Normally, we'd have to do something. But we're not doing anything. We're just watching. But anyway. Um, there you go. What are you? You're going through a bin, Jack. Jack, of all things, you're going through a bin. And g plays just... Okay, g plays has gone to sleep on the sofa. As opposed to the bed. And you want to go to sleep as well? Well, there's a good public floor there. Okay, you want to sleep so you have a shower. That's weird. Okay, Jack, you go have that shower. <laughs> then, I don't know, fall asleep somewhere after you've eaten. What time is it? It's 6.30 in the morning and Jack hasn't been to sleep yet. That's normal. He's normally got the Xbox on and he's playing something till the early hours. Carpool will come for Ryan in about an hour. 
I keep thinking Ryan's G-Play because I keep forgetting that Ryan's the name of the Lara Croft type character. But yes, anyway. Um, that honking isn't the fact that this this episode's coming to an end. <laughs> um, it's, yeah, them lot going to work. So, yay, there we go. Um, oh, go away, go away, go away, go away. Don't care, don't care, don't care. And don't care, don't care, don't, 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 don't care. Right, no, don't go here. What are you doing? You're going for a nap on a park bench, Jack. What day is it? It's Monday. You should be at school. Uh, wrong pair of shoes. But would you like to... Uh, as a junior member of the police force, you still have a great deal of things to learn. Your boss thinks you could start your education off right if you read how to avoid concrete shoes. Doing <laughs> concrete shoes? Isn't that a mob thing? Didn't they set your feet in concrete then check you in a river? Anyway, how to avoid concrete shoes. Doing so just might keep you out of the bottom of the lake. Plus, it'll make your boss happy and get you closer to the next promotion. Uh, objective. Read how to avoid concrete shapes to earn a job performance increase in relationship. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Okay. Town is full of... Oh, I need to buy the book. I see. Right. Okay. I don't actually have a bookshelf. We need to get a bookshelf. Okay. Where's the bookshelf thing? Oh, it's all by rooms. I don't know by rooms. It's all by function. There we go. That's better. Bookshelf. Bookshelf. Cheap bookshelf. That one will do. And... Uh, Ah, there's nowhere to put it. That's not good. Is there nowhere to put this thing? There we go. Okay, got a bookshelf. Lovely. Whether the book that they want is actually in there or not is another matter. Okay, welcome to the family. As the newest member of this criminal organization, you have been tasked with reading Do's and Don'ts of the Dons, a helpful guide for to keep you from offending the wrong man or woman. By finishing the book, you will personally guarantee an increase in your job performance and improve your relationship with the leader. Oh dear God in hell. It's another book reading thing. I don't know. And I don't care. So, um, and everybody's out and about. Right, okay, why aren't you at school? Why aren't you at school? It's Monday. Monday. Monday's a school day. Last time I checked it was anyway. Jack Croft would like to go over to BB Hearts after school. But he's not at school. He's sleeping on a park bench. Let's just say yes and see what happens. Are you... Uh, okay, your bladder is really poor. Energy next to zero. And you're not actually that hungry at the moment. Okay, business as usual. Um, work hard. Take it easy. You? Well, you're, you're kind of a... You're, you're a villain, aren't you? In the game DC Universe Online. G-Play, you are a villain. So we need to make sure that you work hard at being a villain. So, actually, we're going to make you a suck butt. Grovel to the leader. Suck butt. <laughs> Not as fun as it sounds, I'm sure. And where are you? In the school bus. It's a bit late to be in the school bus now, mate. Okay. No, no, no. Wrong button. There we go. Ha ha. What are you doing in there? Go on then, Jack. Go inside. Why aren't you going inside? You're too tired. That's why you're not going inside. Okay, let's check you out. You are... You're groveling to the leader. And you are taking it easy at work. Okay. Anything else? Could anything else happen? Oh, hang on. It's going all slow. No, don't go slow. Fast speed up. Go. Ryan has left work. Ryan has won $239 today. Well done, Ryan. Where have you gone? And she's gone straight to sleep. What about you, G-Play? You're back home. What are you doing? Your energy is also at zero. <laughs> and you've gone straight to sleep as well. But it's only five o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah, this is pretty much me. I'm an early bird. I get up early and what do I do? I, I go to sleep when I get home. That's what I do. What about you, Jack? Your energy, yep, yeah, is piss poor. Jack is behaving inappropriately. <laughs> is he? Oh, I wish. What did he do? What did he do? Oh, wow. Well, I've got to see this. Yeah. Why are you behaving inappropriately, Jack? Gosh. Okay. Gosh. It seems BB Hart really doesn't like Jack. Okay. Go on. Do something. He's helping himself to food. 
He gets really psyched about having anything and everything. Hover over any trait in the symbology to see the benefits. Okay, so he's getting psyched up about something. Okay. And it seems Jack is out past curfew. I think, what time is it? 10.39. Yes, Jack is out past curfew. What are you doing, Jack? What are you doing, Jack? What baby heart doesn't like you? Go home. Jack Croft is breaking the rules and staying out after curfew. Even when he is old and feeble, he will always remember the carefree wildness of his younger days. See that, Jack? They're already talking about when you're old. <laughs> really intense music to indicate that the police... Are... Hang on. Hang on, is that Ryan? Is that you? I'm sorry, that just looks really weird. I called him Ryan and he's wearing a bikini. And she's wearing a bikini. I'm getting confused. Well, Ryan wanted to be a Lara Croft lookalike. Like I said before, Ryan has issues. <laughs> oh, this is strange. This is so very strange. I didn't really know what to expect. But yeah, this is rather peculiar. Maybe I should put another bed in there so that even they can all actually get to sleep if they need to. But um, yeah guys, that's all we've got time for. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know it's been a bit strange with this rather dysfunctional family. The Crofts with Ryan Croft, based after Lara Croft. G Play Croft, based after G Play from DC Universe Online. And Jack from Jack Ale Founder, who is a regular guest on this show, usually playing Defiance with his favourite character, Honey Tits. But he didn't want me to create his avatar as a female character because he's a teenage boy and they don't like to be girls. So, um, yeah, like I said, thank you for watching. Make sure to hit like and subscribe. Leave any comments about the video. Make sure to let me know whether you want to see some more of this. I am thinking of turning this into a series and they've all buggered off. Where have they buggered off to? Come on, Ryan, where are you? You're at... Yep, they're all at work. And... You've actually gone to school. Slack off. Go on, that'll be fun. <laughs> okay, guys. Right, like I said, that's all we've got time for. Make sure to tune in next time for a bit more gamers play of whatever the game I might be playing. It might be gamers play Sims 3 from now on. I hope to hear from you soon. Ciao for now.